Well, as you can see, I'm finally back at Great Adventure today. And today is Sunday, August 30th, I believe. And, uh, yeah, I would say Great Adventure is trying to get back the uh, money they, got, they lost from COVID and everything. But it was always $25 for general parking and 50 for preferred parking, which is pretty uh, expensive. You see King the Car, Lantern. It's still really early, so I'm still waiting for them to open the gates. It's not even 10 o'clock, so I still have some time to kill. But I'm here, not to chit chatting, and let's get inside the park. Also, I'm not sure if this was always here, but now they have this sign out here to support any unsafe behavior. Because I know there's been a lot of fights at Great Adventure recently, and I actually saw them the last time I was here, so yeah, animals. Just got inside the park, and I might be a little Kina Ka fanboy today, or fan dude or guy, because I'm 30, I'm not a boy anymore. <sighs> you are a loser, my friend. You're a loser. A failure. But anyway, I saw it running before, so hopefully it's open. Once I see it running, I'm gonna head over there. But for now, I'm gonna change it up and I'm gonna do the Joker. Yeah. Never thought I'd be saying this, but first of all, the day's gonna be Harley Quinn. Why don't you just go for Harley Quinn for my first ride of the day? Never in my life would I ever think I would do this ride first. But I wasn't gonna do Joker. But the line for the locker was so long, so I was walking towards Skull Mountain, put my uh, phone and everything in the locker over there, and I realized Harley Quinn had a walk on. So, yeah, why not? We're heading to the locker, then we'll probably head back to uh, Joker to give that a ride. Just got off the Joker and Skyscreamer. You know, Joker, I flipped three and a half times, so we're doing really good today. You know, a lot of people don't like the 4D free spins, but I don't mind them, they're a lot of fun. Only if you flip three times, otherwise it's, I feel the pain. And Skyscreamer was good as well, the breeze was a uh, nice break from all this heat. And it's also not that hot today, so, as you can see, in line for Nitro. So much has happened, I just got off the nitro and I was online, this group of six tried cutting the entire line. And the guy in front of me got pissed off, so he told them that there's a separate line for the flash pass because they say they had a flash pass and everything. And they, they got into like a huge argument. So they finally left after everyone was like pitching at them. Then I ordered something from the dining plan, I wanted to change my reservation and I got like an error. Then I, I went to go pick up my food and said I had the uh, I had lunch already. So there's still glitches with that. Great to see all these photo ops out. I'm digging it. And also, hopefully, they have holiday in the park this year. Because I probably like Fright Fest, and that's probably my second favorite. Even though I'm making it seem like Great Adventure has like so many events. The yeah, Wonders Woman line looks pretty long. It's just about coming out of the queue. I'll probably head over to the other side of the park. Yeah, that was crazy what happened on Nitro though. Okay, just to speak in cyborg clothes, this area is very dead. It's been like that all season so far. The poor old Justice League. Cyborg, I don't give you. It's like in the car run, so when you see that, go there. You never know when it's gonna break down. Alright, let's try this again. Put you guys in a locker. Next is Lumanjaro. Just got off a team the cows in the sixth row. That's going really good today. I also haven't had a problem with my mask in any of the coasters besides Kim the Cow so far. I really have to like hold on to it, otherwise I definitely would have lost it. I think someone on my chain actually lost their mask. So I guess it sucks to suck. Yeah, I did a lot so far. It's kind of busy for a Sunday. 
of course, I still need to head over to uh, El Toro later on. Hope we get a few rides on that. Yeah, in line for Zimanjaro. I'm digging it. Just admire that drop. It is gorgeous. Of course, you still see some of the uh, rolling on the track right there. And over here, you get a nice view of Team the Car. It might actually be going off right now, so let's see. Okay, here it comes. Just going down. And there's a little airtime here, which you don't get that much of a time, but it's still cool to have, I guess. Yeah, welcome to the world's longest uh, queue line. You should definitely put like, a coaster or something right over here where Rolling Thunder used to be. They have a lot of uh, space to work with. So, yeah, I'll see you guys once I get off of uh, Zimanjaro. Over here, might as well admire how tall came the cars. Over here, you get a great angle. So, if you want to get some off right footage of the car, come over here on Zoom and Jar's line. This in the parking lot is probably the best view you'll get of it. There's absolutely no way to Zoom and Jar. It's literally a complete walk on. I just noticed over there, they have like a macho nacho truck. Other places you can eat, maybe that's for after the safari. I never noticed that. We just got off a zoom in Jaro. Since the car is taking forever, I'll get some footage of this. And of course, I'm going to speed this up because this is kind of boring waiting for it to get to the top. But it's going all the way up there. Also, a shout out to the rod operator. It's like doing a countdown, then they like 10, 9, and they drop you at like 8. Surprises most people. Kind of hear him. But it's almost 1 o'clock or 1.30. So it's, that means it's time for the, uh, the pregame. Getting back to the car for about a half an hour or so. Let's do this. Sundays were the best time to come. Look at that line for Superman. Definitely much busier on Sundays. Look at the parking lot. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. God damn flying here! I can't get them out! Jesus Christ! Thank you. hit up Bizarro. And hopefully got a runaway mine train because I haven't been on that all season yet. Even though it sucks, I still want to get on it because it's been so long. The line for Bizarro it looks like it has maybe like a 15 or 20 minute wait. So it's not too bad.
Let's go up with Zorro. They're trying beautiful. They got the third row. A little uh, rocky. It wasn't too bad. Didn't really head bang. That's always a good thing. Just got a milkshake of Johnny Rockets. So I'm just heading there now. Right for Skull Mountain is out of the queue. That's how busy it is on a Sunday. And of course, a closer look, but it looks like it's the same as last time I was here. Still nice to look at though. Yep, same as last week. There you go, see Jersey Devil in the back. <laughs> but yeah, it's really busy for a Sunday. Each of the major courses has at least an hour wait. Maybe just around an hour. So I'm just chilling in the shade right now, just trying to kill some time. I just had a shake from Giant Rockets, so I'm like literally in a food coma. I still can't believe that's a part of the uh, snack for your diet plan. I think it's like seven bucks if you don't have the dining plan. But I couldn't even finish it. They gave you a big portion. But yeah, just chilling out for now. And I'll probably get some more coasters in a little bit. What's that? And right there, you see Nitro's line coming out of the queue. It is busy for a Sunday. And I'll film this just because I don't think I ever filmed this before. It used to be a route over here. I'm not sure what they're doing with Road Runner Express. That was the other cake list that they had in this section. But now they're down a coaster. Also gaining one. The park's pretty crowded, so I'm probably gonna just chill out and head out. That's what I do it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out. video I just wanted to stop at the park down the road here and get some off-ride shots from the lake because you get a pretty nice view from over here as you just saw I got a nice shot of nitro I to see uh, Jersey Devil from here top of King Ka. yeah it's a nice view yeah it should be here hopefully in a week or two and I'm also going to try to make it out to uh, Hershey Park this fall. I'm not sure if I can get out to Dorney since they are closing Labor Day weekend or I think September 7th or something. But who knows? We'll see what happens. But yeah, as always, thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys next video. Peace out.